Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back to Interstage Window, my Saturday stream with a working microphone now. Oh my God, <laughs> I don't know what happened. Um, we had to restart the whole stream. Anyways, we're gonna be playing classic World of Warcraft hardcore on my Warlock. We had two people on YouTube, we probably lost them. Um, sorry, sorry YouTube peoples, sorry YouTube peoples that were here early and hung out on the, hung out on the, the screen, the starting soon screen. Yes, Lunar with the first hello, hello. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I have no idea. I'm, I assume you can hear me this time, otherwise you would have put in the chat that you still cannot hear me. Um, so yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Um, yep. <laughs> One YouTube dude changed a Twitch. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Brenna. We're about to enter an ad break. So I'm going to just chat with chat. You can hear me, yay. I'm just going to chat with chat and get the game started so you guys don't miss anything. I know ad break's about to start in like 30 seconds. So yeah, um, pitfalls. Of, it's supposed to happen on the starting soon screen and just be done by the time we actually start. But anyways, yeah, so sorry. Don't go anywhere, Brenna. I love you. <laughs> ah! I don't know what happened. It was so weird. OBS, like I could see the, you know, the audio thingy in OBS and it tells you, like I could see the microphone one moving up and down, moving up and down, no problems. And you're like, can't hear you. And it's like, OBS says you can, so I don't, I don't know. So I just rebooted anyways. <laughs> How are you doing today? How are you doing today, Lunar? I hope you're having a fantastic day. <laughs> Uh, so at least at least my new peoples, um, they're stuck in an ad right now, so they won't have to see the weird little frame rate thingies while I get the world of the Warcrafts going. <laughs> ah, let's open my drink. Let's open my drink. <laughs> ah. I love technology. It's so fun. Oh my god. <laughs> so much fun with technology yeah i've got a guava lacroix today which is my favorite flavor i love them so much i just spilled some on my hand because apparently i have a hole in my lip there we go all right all right, 30 more seconds on the ad break. We're almost there. I'm doing where my character Delilah is officially being courted by her crush and it was super adorable. Oh my God, yes, yes. Oh my God, I love that. Lunar, oh my God. Um, so, okay, so I have a question for you. I saw your uh, your channel point, your deem, your channel point goal. Does that mean you're gonna, you're gonna launch a Discord app? Like you're gonna mod one? You're gonna mod one, you're gonna run one? Like, is that a thing? Is that gonna happen? Like, is this, is this like eventually for sure going to happen? <clears throat> Cause I feel like if it's a challenge on your, on your Twitch, like eventually it will happen. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay. They're out of the ad break. They're out of the ad break. <gasps> we can start, we can start wowing it up. We can start wowing it up. Welcome guys. Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay. I have to show you, look at this beautiful pink tabard. I joined a guild called rainbow and they have a pink tabard. So I'm very excited about it. Okay. Let's get in. Let's get in. We're gonna try to do the two elite quests in, um, we're gonna try to do the two elite quests that are in uh, Stone Talon, in the den. We're gonna go to the den. I'm gonna hang out in the Night Elf's living room. I need a coaster in here, oh my God. I need a coaster. Yes, if we reach the goal. Do you have a premise in mind? Do you know what you wanna do? Okay. Here we go. We're in Sunrock Retreat. We're gonna need to find a group. So let's get started on that. Um, see if we can do that. Let's do it in four, four as well. That's right, my looking for group is four. Yes, it is. Okay, I've got both the quests. I've got the den and I've got the Horde Presence one, both. Um, cause I'm OP like that. We did, I did kill the Alliance packs in, uh, the Alliance pack in the Barrens. So I have that. It's no longer Halloween in the game. Rip in pieces. Rip in pieces Halloween. Okay, if we cannot do this, if we cannot find a group to, to go to the den, um, then we're gonna go, we're gonna go back over to Thousand Needles and continue 
questing there. But I really would like to do the den quests, you know what I'm saying? I would really like to do them. So we're gonna see. We're gonna see. I'm just seeing if anybody's saying anything. I don't see much. I don't see much going on. I don't see much going on. Okay, so I have a question for all for all you wow peoples. All you wowzers. Who's excited for sod? I can't wait. I can't wait to I can't wait to sod it up. Oh my god, I'm gonna get all my sodomites together and um and we're gonna go sod it up in Ashenville. Can't wait. I'm so excited. Um it's the classic plus that I've always that I that I want. Like, I don't know if it's going to be, like, all my hopes and dreams, but oh my god. It's Classic Plus. It's Classic Plus for real, y'all. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. It's going to be so good. And because the level band's only 25 at first, I feel like... I feel like I could totally, like, have plenty of time for alts and things. So we're definitely going to have a warlock. Definitely going to have a druid. And it's kind of like, okay, I'm still going the right way. And it's kind of like, I don't know. It's like hardcore was like here and gone so fast because Sod's going to be the new hotness. Sod's going to be the new hotness and it's going to be like hardcore who? Hardcore what? I do not know her. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited and I'm going to stream it. We're going to stream it. Okay. Thursday night launch. However, <laughs> however long I can stay up with my old ass lady self and uh and fri and uh friday i took friday off of work i took friday off of work i'm that excited i cannot wait i'm gonna get the metamorphosis rune and i'm gonna be a warlock tank oh my god it's gonna be so good it's gonna be so good i can't wait to uh to tank up in uh black fathom okay why does nobody want to kill night elves with me Come on, peoples. We're gonna run all the way there. And no bites. <clears throat> I thought I had an important message, but I didn't. It was not important. <laughs> Sorry for checking my phone during stream. Okay. <clears throat> Come on, I just want to kill some night elves. Maybe if we run up there, we'll like see some people. That's what I'm hoping for. Oh, I need a demon armor. I hope, I hope. So can you guys believe, can you guys believe we're 30 and we're not dead yet? I kind of can't believe it. Do you think we can get to 40 before I get too obsessed with sod? That would be really neat. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the follow, friendo. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Uh, oh, it's our new friend, Breno. Hello, hello. You do? You think I can get to 40 before I get too obsessed with Sod? Thank you for believing in me. Thank you for believing in me. We're going to try. Lunar, it comes out at the end of the month on the 30th. Thursday the 30th. It's like really soon. It's cool as heck. I really hope that the sod announcement didn't kill the hardcore population to where there's just nobody here. Because I was doing pretty good. I've been doing really good with like getting people to come do elite quests and group quests with me. Like not really having any problems. But like no one is responding to this. And we kind of need a whole group because it's like all up in like a cave little area, you know, scary, scary. Definitely cannot go alone. Oh! 
You too, you too. Okay, let's invite them. Somebody else just put the same message. Okay, fucking sweet. There's two of us now. Okay, so now we can look for more. Yo. Gonna try to get us more. Okay, what level is this person? Okay, they're 34 shaman. Okay, so that's good. That's good. 34 is good. Shaman is good. This bitch. Why? Why, cat? Alright, I am healed. Okay. Alright. Shamans always make good besties. We have met so many cool shamans. Sweet. Okay, so we have a we have a healer. We have a healer. Okay, it's just right up here. Oh, did I do my defense in between streams? I was gonna show you guys that. Okay, yes, I leveled up my defense in between streams, so you can see my my defense is not um, noobish. I am leveling it up in between streams. I thought I almost forgot to do it, but no, it's just been a minute because we took that break doing the um doing the other game. So we didn't play a while last week. So I just forgot. Okay. Alright. Let's do boop boop. Have heels. PST. Have heels. PST. Okay, maybe that'll get some bites if I say have heels. Come on, people. Come on, people. Oh, I need to hide my cape. So you guys can see my beautiful pink all the time. Oh, there it is. It's called cloak. Show cloak. No, we don't want to show the cloak. Because we just want to be pink. Want to be pink. We definitely need more, I don't think, even though, like, even though this person's a bit overleveled for it, I just think two is dangerous in there. There's a lot of spots with, like, lots of mobs, and they're all elites. So we definitely need some more. Fuck yeah. Got a druid. Got a bear tank. <clears throat> Let's see if we have a tank too. Yeah, on my way. Fucking sweet! Oh my god, these are my two new best friends! Okay. Looking for two more. Have tank and heals. Two more. It's happening, you guys. It's happening. We're going to get some night elves. We're going to get some night elves. And teach them a lesson. It would be really nice if we could have a full group make this easy peasy. Make this easy peasy. I was fishing in Stranglethorn and I got the Spirit of Zandalar. I was I tried to get Rend beforehand, but I just kept missing it. They don't the, Rend doesn't drop so often. Got to go back into Wolf Quest off stream and try to fix what happened. I saw like I went to I had a, a when I was watching you last night like I got up 
um, to go to the bathroom or something. I can't remember. Anyways, I was gone for like 10, 15 minutes and I come back and you were offline already. And I was like, what? I was like, what? You know, and I did, re I did notice like as I was kind of like lurking and watching, like it kept disconnecting you. So it was like something was going on. And I didn't, I wasn't sure if it was like Twitch or what. But I did see what you were talking about. So hopefully you can fix it. You are still in my opinion, as far as I can see, the the biggest Wolf Quest streamer on this platform, um, which is like, which like it's like a niche game, but it's like so amusing to me. Like it's such a good game to stream. While we're while we're waiting, while we're waiting, everybody click that heart, and go follow Club Moon. Go follow Lunar. She does a lot of Wolf Quest and Sims. Um, it is Sims 4, but we still love her. It is Sims 4, but we still love her. It is fun. Thank you so much. I agree. I think it is. Yes. It's a good game. All right, one of our new friends is here. Okay, where's our, where's Balrog? Oh, they come in. Oh yeah, I can put that we have summon. We do have summon. Oh my God. Oh my God. You're right. Oh my God, you're right. <laughs> Why was I not typing that? Looking for two more. Have summon and tank and heals already. PST. <clears throat> okay. Be smart and strategic, Karen. My God. Have summon and tank and heals already. PST. Okay, I put it in both. One in general and in looking for group. That's true, because we got two friends now, so they can help me summon. Come on, let's go. Is this my best health stone? Yeah. My buttons just messed up. Get on there. There we go. Oh, that's nice of them buffing my pet. Buffing my pet. But since we have a tank, I should probably imp it up. Let's get it in. Sorry you wasted. Sorry you wasted. doing it. We didn't find others, but it's cool.
Game face is on, guys. Game face is on. These elite bitches, they don't know. Rock them up. Alright, got him, got him. One down. Oh, that was a rare brother raven oak. So the rare is up in here too. I don't know what he drops. Probably leather stuff. <laughs> Probably stuff for our druid and shaman friend that are with us, not for me. <laughs> Hello. Oh, that was smart. Get this guy that walks back and forth before we go in the room. I feel well taken care of by this group. the heels. I was band-aiding.
There's the rare. It is cloth. Okay, wait. Is that an upgrade for me? Oh, but that's not an upgrade for me. Not an upgrade. Oh, um... Since you're your how since you did the howl on the um the starting soon screen. Wait, I need to play a howl for Lunar. There we go. That's for you, girl. The other rare is up. Naltzar. more cloth drops okay oh but it's not an upgrade either that's okay this was blessed run blessed run all right third key this was good shit okay now we got to go to the guy
That's so nice of them. This healer still heals me even when I'm tapping. So many healers will not do that. So I always gotta have my band-aids. Oh no, at 59, one level away. One level away, tragic. Oh my god, that sucks. Rip Grindor the Druid. Which dungeon is this? Hey, Dilict, um, how are you doing? So just to let you know, since you're on YouTube, if, uh, if you come over to Twitch, that's the chat that appears on the screen, but if you'd like to keep your chats private, you're welcome to stay on YouTube. Um, this is not a dungeon. This is the Talon Den in Stone Talon. Um, and it's just a, a cute little, like, elite druid um, night elf area that has two quests inside of it. So, like, after you kill Ordanus in Ashenvale, there's a follow-up quest to come in here. And then after, also after you, um kill the alliance patrol in the barrens the follow-up quest is is to come in here so it's just two little two little follow-up quests from chains that um that you can do in here and it's great because we get to kill some smelly night elves because as everybody knows alliance doesn't shower especially night elves There's a couple of rares in here too. Two, two of the rares were up for us, um, and they did drop good stuff for me. But unfortunately, it wasn't upgrades to what I already had, so not too bad. The heck is Dotty Pet Kendra? Hello, Kendra. How are you doing today? Oh my gosh! Please tell me how you are. Um, you know, with everything going on with you right now, I, I need a Kendra update. Um, no problem. No problem, Dilked. Uh, thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me. Dead? Oh no. Is bad. Is bad. I got my, um, booster on Wednesday. My dumbass. My dumbass got my booster on Wednesday after work, thinking it's gonna be fine. I was so annoyed because it was my third attempt and it fi I finally worked out and I got it. You know, so I wasn't really thinking. Thursday, my ass was out. Oh my god, I was done. Um, I pushed myself to work. Ooh, upgrade. Upgrade. Um, but it's strength. Okay, Oz oh, they're both rolling greed. Can I need? Can I need? Are they gonna be mad at me? It's strength ring. Um yeah, so like my ass was out. I worked like four hours on Thursday. I was fine by Friday, but like I felt so bad. I felt so freaking bad for because I sh I could have planned it better. My first two attempts that didn't work out to get the um the vaccine were um were on Fridays. Like I planned properly. Oh my god! And this one was the worst. It like knocked me out so bad. I had fatigue. I had nausea. I had chills. It was awful. It was awful. Um, what are you rolling for sod? I'm so glad you asked, new best friend. I'm so glad you asked. I'm gonna roll a warlock, of course. Um, so yeah, we're gonna sod it up. Um, we're gonna sod it up Thursday when it drops. I assume it's gonna be like a 6 p.m. thing on Thursday, just like hardcore, you know. Um, we're gonna sod it up, um, as a warlock, uh, undead warlock. Just like this girl here, probably gonna name her Karen Terry as well, because Karen's probably already gonna be taken, so I'm gonna do Karen Terry. Um, and, and yeah, I'm gonna stream it right here on that day. It's gonna be amazing. I took Friday off of work just so that I could hang out with you guys while I played. Um, it's gonna be the best. I am so freaking excited. It looks amazing. But we have just one coat of paint to do in Eliza's room and then it's ready for her. Oh, good. Oh my God, that's amazing. I'm so glad. At least Eliza will have her, her room ready. That's like the most important, right? So I'm really good. Nice, the hype is real. The hype is so real. What are you rolling? Okay, what are you playing? Tell me, tell me your plans. And since the level bracket's only 25, I should have plenty of time for like a druid alt like I like to do. So like, it should be amazing. I should be able to warlock and druid it up. I'm gonna get that metamorphosis rune. It's gonna be so good. 
Um, yes, I can't wait. I put a picture of the floor in our group chat. Okay, I'll have to go look. I'll have to go look. So yeah, I mean, it's not like the classic plus I dreamed of exactly, but like it is classic plus and I love the ideas that they're going with. Um, Agrand is, um, he, he understands us. I feel like he gets it. You know, the things that he says, um, like, I'm just like, oh, I just feel like he understands, you know, uh, about the, you know, like, you want the classes to still feel unique. Um, very, very important for, for, uh, for classic, you know, wow. Fight out or hearth. Um, so like, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. All right, new friends, are we fighting out or hearthing? I will roll a lock, of course, affliction spec. Dilked, where, how have we not met before? Um, how have we not met before? Affliction spec is my heart. You, there's so many times, so many times in lock world, you cannot play it. So many times, but like, I really want an affliction spec okay because it, he some of the posts have implied that there's going to be like spec and off spec you know it's gonna be really easy to do all that right so i want an affliction spec for my deeps and i want um where does this turn in where does this turn in at i can't remember do you actually turn it in in the barons Oh, you do? It's, like, up here. Okay, let's fly to Crossroads. Um, for my DPS, I want to do an Affliction spec. Uh, but I just don't think that's going to be the meta. Like, looking at the Chaos Bolt rune and everything, like, I just think... I think Firelock um, Destruction is going to be the meta. So we'll see. We'll see if I get my hopes and dreams. But then, for, like, an, an my alternative spec, uh, a Demonology tank, right, with the Metamorphosis and everything. Oh, my God. I feel like a demonology tank with a succubus Greetings. pet is gonna rock it in PvP as well. Like, I just think that PvP is gonna be really, really good for that spec that I cannot wait. Um, I can't wait because we're gonna have we're gonna have the like the world PvP in Ashen Vale. Like, it's just gonna be so fun, and I can't wait to get my little Ashen Vale mount and run around on my Wolfie. Uh, it's gonna be so good. The DP girly on TikTok is all I want to hear you hear when you say DPS. Oh my god, please. Okay, Kendra. So this new this new mode that's dropping at the end of the month, you'll love this. You'll love this. Speaking of the DP girl, um, is called Season of Discovery, abbreviation S O D, sod. It's called sod. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? They did it on purpose. They did it on purpose. They're setting us up for all the all the puns. All the puns. Same for me, but I just like the RP vibes of Affliction Spec so much. True. You get it. You get it. It's exactly true. Um, I just love dotting. I love dotting. You know, my, my uh, MMO life started out as um, Baby Karen twisting songs as a bard in EverQuest. And... Um, I was just like, ever since then, like I always want to play the dot class, whatever the dot class is. I just want to like dot, 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 you know? So I do love affliction, but it's usually just not the meta. And so I don't really get to play it super often at end game, but I will level up, you know, dot, dot, dotting. <clears throat> yes, yes. <laughs> Kendra, you know what you should do? You know what you should do? WoW is not that taxing of a game. You should download and sod it up with me. <laughs> Wouldn't that be so much fun for us to do together? <laughs> oh my word. I amuse myself. I amuse myself. My ex was so into WoW. I feel like you've told me this before. And so WoW has a bad taste in your mouth because of the ex. I feel like I know this story. Hopefully I'm not remembering wrong and thinking of someone else that has a similar story. Because that story is <laughs> so, uh, so common for ladies of our age. <laughs> I was into lineage too. Well, that makes sense. Well, that makes sense. 
It really is, right? <laughs> I could never play WoW because I had a I had a, a boyfriend that was way too into it and it poisoned me. Like that's very common. All right, let's run up and turn in. Okay. While we're doing that, let's check out our new ring. Okay, so we've got Coral Band of the Bear and Horn Ring. Stam and Spirit. Int and Spirit. And this is Stam and Strength. I, I do really like that plus four Stam for Hardcore. So I think we're gonna replace this one with the Horn Ring. Okay, what else did I get? Oh yeah, Male Leather. Okay, someone else placed this, so I didn't need, end up needing to do it. So we'll trash that in a minute. Didn't end up needing to use this. So we're gonna have to trash all these, I think. Not the etched file, we need you. Okay, let's put my cloth down here. Oh, it says it's an upgrade. It says I should be using this instead of Totemic Clan Ring. I guess because of the the stamina. Well, damn. That's probably true. Probably Int is not as appropriate. Okay, we can sell a lot of this. Uh, this stuff needs to be disenchanted. Okay, so when we stop running, we'll disenchant some stuff too. Keep our bags clean. And all this needs to be trashed or sold. Right here. But Kendra, re it's going to be like a whole new mode for classic WoW. Seasons of Discovery. It's going to have banding. So basically, we, you start out and the max level is only 25. And there's going to be a new raid. Um, in Black Fathom deeps and uh, and there's like this whole discovery mechanic where you can go on quests or find locations or just all kinds of different ways that you find things called runes that you can add to your character for like cool new abilities so basically like abilities from later expansions that are really cool that we don't have in classic they're adding it in and they're also kind of like spreading around some different things like I saw there's a rune, I think, if I, unless someone lied, like I'm trying to remember if this is true or if I just read it, because people like to lie. <laughs> but I think there's going to be That's a rune for said. like hunters to get kings instead. Hey, that is what she said. That is what she said. <laughs> it's true. It's so like hunters, hunters to get kings, um, and you know some stuff like that. Where because on horde, you know, I just can't play alliance. I just can't play alliance. But those pally buffs. But I can't. I tried. My heart is not Alliance. If only, but it's not. Okay, what is this? Oh, Desolus. Oh, and that's Glowing Shard still. Okay. Swarm Grows, I think, is, is also in Desolus. I can't remember where Swarm Grows is. So yeah, we're going to do that. So Thursday night on the 30th is when it launches. I'm going to try to stream that. So basically I'm just going to go after dinner, probably get on stream and do that. And then I took off the Friday off of work. So we're going to stream all day Friday and just sod it up and hang out and make new friends and have all kinds of adventures. And it's not hardcore. So it's okay if I die. <laughs> so y'all can see how I really play when I'm balls to the walls and don't give a fuck. Um, unlike hardcore where I'm like so careful and nervous. Um, so yeah, that'll be really fun. And there's no PTR. So, like, there is some data mining going on of people, like, discovering things that are in the, the build or whatever, but they're not actually letting us play Seasons of Discovery on PTR, so we can't fully discover everything. So there will be, like, literally stuff in there that nobody has found. So that'll be a really interesting experience. Okay, is this upgrade? That's not an upgrade. Okay. For the Horde. Alrighty. Whee! Ugh. All right. While well, we still have the fast run speed, let's run back down, and then we're gonna fly. We're gonna fly over to um, Thousand Needles and continue there. Wait, I need to disenchant this shit. Uh, disenchant. Mm. 
of the whale. Such an unfortunate, such an unfortunate suffix. Nobody wants of the whale. Useless for all. This can go in the trash. Yes, I do not need Kadrak's flag no more. And the gatekeeper key. Don't need that. Do you know if there will be just one server for Sod? Sorry, can't ask in chat on Twitch because it requires some kind of verification. Oh, yeah. It's just it's just the normal, like, Twitch phone verification or email verification. Like, I have it set to just any verification is fine. But I think you have to, like, accept on, the e like, your email or something. But anyways, um... Uh, yes, I think that there will be multiple, like, okay, and here's why I think there will be multiple servers, because they already said that they're listening about how upset the Australians and New Zealanders are about no Oceanic server, and then the, in the East Asians, of course, they would play on the Oceanic server. Um, there's a lot of people that have said they're super upset that there's no Oceanic server. And my understanding from the response is like, they're saying they're listening. That says to me that they do want to have an Oceanic server for Sod. Also, um, when it comes to hardcore, right, when that launched, like all my people that I knew that had played WoW were interested and excited for hardcore, right? But that's not the chatter for Sod. For Sod, like I'm seeing people that like they don't really, they haven't played WoW in so long. They have, they don't really care about it, but and they maybe these people have only ever played retail and they've never they never like came back for classic era none of that and they're excited for sod and thinking about starting it up again with that news like multiple of my streamer friends um that i did not even know had any interest in wow at all are talking about it i think it's going to be so much bigger than hardcore so i think we're definitely going to have more than we have what what three servers for hardcore we have east coast west coast and um, a european server right and that's it just the three i think we're definitely going to have more i definitely think we're going to have at least um an oceanic server as well and potentially um multiple us servers now i don't know if they're going to do like east coast west coast but i think considering the the world pvp or whatever like we might have like literally um like PVP server and PVE server, right? Now that might mean that we have four. So this is what I'm speculating is that we have an East Coast and a West Coast PVE and an East Coast and a West Coast PVP. So we have four. And then um, EU, Europe gets two, a PVE and a PVP. And Oceanic, also a PVE and a PVP. That's what my, based on like how much more chatter I'm seeing with seasons of discovery that's kind of where my mind is now i don't know i have no inside information i don't i can't talk to the devs like uh, you know I have, I have no idea i'm purely guessing off of the level of chatter that i see in my circles but that would kind of make sense to me i think people are very very excited about it people have been asking for classic plus for a really long time and like this is it classic plus is here you know classic plus is here that's what this is so that's what i think but we'll see they have not released any information yet so, I do not know. <sighs> I do not know. But I do think that it sounds more interesting. Because hardcore, hardcore is very niche. Like, I've talked about this a couple of times on stream, but I love streaming hardcore for you guys. It's really, really fun to stream. But, like, my solo character, my druid that I was playing by myself, she died twice in her 20s. And the truth is, is just like, I realized solo play hardcore, like that's just not for me. <laughs> like it's fun when, when something dangerous happens and I'm like, I'm freaking out with you guys, you know, or you're cheering me on, like you can do this or whatever, but like by myself, like it just isn't. Um, I think it takes a certain kind of player and that type of player is not me. <laughs> um, but Saad isn't hardcore. Death. It's like, it's like way, it's going to be way different. So I'm very excited. Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh yeah, we're going to Thousand Needles down here. Oh, I also noticed in the office a lot of people are saying that this this is it. I'm coming back for that. Yeah, exactly. That's exactly what I'm saying. Now, um, where I, I haven't heard any office chatter, but the truth is, IT sits really far away from where my team sits, and I. But I like some of them gotta be. 
some of the IT people got to be. I, they got to be. You know, if I sat near them, I think I would hear office chatter too. But the place that I sit is like a kind of small sequestered area of our building um, with just like my team and like one other small team. So I don't hear it. But um, but they're not really gamers. Like I think I'm the, I'm the gamerest gamer in, in that group. Maybe a couple of other people, but not really, not many. Like the really, the really like nerdy people in my, that sit near me at work are like readers. They read a lot, you know, read sci-fi fantasy or YA or whatever. So I haven't heard it, but I just feel like from what I'm seeing in my online circles, like the, I, I'm, there's gotta be like members of the IT team or whatever that are saying that there's got to be. So yeah, I think there's going to be more servers than hardcore for sure. But I don't think they're going to release a ton of servers because I know what they don't want is like six months from now. Oh, oh wait, no. It's level 60 from falling. They sewer slided. Um, they sewer slided. There's no way. There's no way that wasn't on purpose. Last words for healing set better than, oh, well, maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> maybe not. I don't know. So yeah, I just think there's going to be more than hardcore, but I don't think they're going to have too many because what they probably, I'm sure what they don't want is like six months from now when it's not like the shiny new thing that um, they end up with servers that are empty because of this. I think they rather would have, you know, overpopulated servers at the start and use layering than the other way around, you know? Hello, Koneko. How you doing? How you doing, my friend? Are you having a good Saturday? But yeah, I think Seasons of Discovery is going to bring a lot of people back that haven't even touched classic era, period, you know, that are just like either not that haven't played WoW in a long time at all, period, or are like retail players. I really think that. All right, what are we doing? Dalek Scouts. Is that over here? Yes. Okay, we're gonna go kill. We're gonna go kill some uh, some centaurs. Having a great Saturday. Looking today because EP. Take a nap, Koneko. Keep the just keep the stream up lurking, just like you're doing, and have a nap. Uh, I'll I'll try to ASMR for you. We'll do some wow ASMR for Koneko. I gotta turn the game sound down if I'm gonna whisper like that, cause y'all can't hear me. I know you can't hear me. <laughs> okay, you can probably hear me now. <sighs> it's wow ASMR time, so Koneko can have a nap. <laughs> <laughs> okay just kidding we're not gonna do that i can't do that for too long i can't asmr for too long okay we gotta go kill some okay we gotta go kill some some uh some guys we gotta go kill some some guys okay and we gotta not fall okay don't do that one we'll do this one <laughs> oh my god screamer kitty kitty I can't nap. My sleep schedule's messed up enough of it as it is. Oh no. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I hate when my sleep schedule gets all jacked up. I can nap like a champ though. I can nap like a champ. Okay, we need our blueberry. We're gonna go get some centaurs. They won't know. They won't know what hit them. They won't know. But it'll be me. I'll hit them. Okay, let's go. They're just right up here. Let's go to the edge of their camp and just try to pick them off. Oh, that's a crack stalker. He's gonna come, come get me. I hate when I'm sick and I sleep all day and then I feel better and my schedule's all messed up. Yeah, luckily, luckily when I was um, sick from my shot, I did not mess up my sleep schedule, even though I took like a really long nap in the middle of the day. But I still managed to sleep at night because I was still feeling kind of bad in the evening, although I did start to feel better. Okay, get some Galax. <clears throat> this should be Torin land, not Centaur land. That's what we believe, so we're just gonna kill them. Um, because that's that's good to do. I need to get closer. Okay, we need scouts, wranglers, and wind chasers. Did you see?
see that? He tried to heal. He tried to heal. So rude. Why would he do that? No one gets to heal. Except for me and my friends. I'm out of range. There's some um really scary for hardcore quests in this zone. Don't you heal. Um, there's like a he did. Um like elites and like in inside caves and things. Um, so yeah, we're gonna see how it goes. We're gonna see how it goes. This zone is pretty dangerous. Um, I, this zone, I haven't, it hasn't killed me in hardcore, because I haven't made it this far before, but I, I am nervous that this is gonna be, this is gonna be the end of, uh, of our little warlock here. We'll see. These bitches, I need to, like, I need to interrupt them. I don't have an interrupt. should have an interrupt. Maybe we'll get a rune inside for that. He netted my blueberry. It's too far away. I can't cast that yet. You know what with all the um the BlizzCon announcements though? I feel kind of really bad for uh for Wrath players. I feel like Wrath is such a good expansion and they're gonna get pushed into Kata. And it doesn't look like there's any plans to keep, like, Wrath-era servers the same way that there's, like, Classic-era servers. So I feel, like, so bad for them. I feel like we deserve to have a couple of Wrath servers, you know, that just stay on Wrath. And that you don't necessarily have to go to Kata. It's just such a good expansion, you know? And I have to say, I was not a Kata fan. Kata was when I started losing Steam for a while. And, uh... Like when we were when we were watching it, I think like my main comment was like, seriously, nobody wants Kata. Nobody wants Kata. People want Wrath with pet battles. Cause that's what I did all of Kata. <laughs> that's what I did. Um so yeah. But we'll see. We'll see. I don't know. I feel like they should they should have Wrath servers. Like the Wrath kiddos deserve that. It's a good expansion. Excuse you. What you resisting? Oh, he's resisting the torment. I thought he resisted one of my dots. I was about to say, uh, <laughs> excuse me. But no. He didn't resist a dot. You still netted? You still netted. Okay. You're out the net. Okay. These poor um, centaurs that were that were killing because they deserve it. Um, they're kind of like pinned, right? They're pinned between like Torin territory and Quillbore territory. Um, they could not possibly like get outside resources because it's like hostile all around them. These poor centaurs. Oh my God! Stop killing yourself. Okay, so that's enough wind chasers. 
We still need wranglers and scouts. I hope now that they will figure out what to do with the ears, especially since Bobby is gone and Metzen is back, right? Right? I have to, okay, I have to tell you the truth, though. I have to tell you the truth. I had hopes. I had hopes that Chris Metzen would say something that made me interested in retail again. It didn't work. It didn't work. I kind of felt, I kind of felt like, it kind of felt fakey hearing him talk. It kind of felt like Blizzard was like, hey, Chris Metzen, you guys love Chris Metzen. Um, you know, if Chris Metzen says that you're going to come back to retail, right? And it's like, you know, Chris Metzen just getting up there and saying, come back to retail is not enough. Like, show me something. Show me why I should come back to retail. Don't just trot Chris Metzen out like I'm going to listen because it's Chris Metzen. You know, so I left... I left the opening ceremony feeling very unimpressed, and I did not watch the retail panel, I have to say. Um, it felt like they thought Chris Metzen's cachet alone was enough, like his presence alone was enough, and I'm just left feeling like, mm, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I don't know. I don't know. I do have more trust in, uh, in Chris Metzen, um, but... Everything he said so far, I just left feeling like, all right, Chris, thanks. Prove it. So we'll see. I don't know. I might be totally wrong. Like they might, these, these new three, the three expansions or whatever, like they might release the first one and it's amazing. And I was wrong to be skeptical. Like that might happen, but that's how I feel right now. It felt a bit, a bit like he wanted to say they have crazy shit planned, but he can't say it because of legal reasons. Yeah, it felt like he was holding back. It felt like he was holding back for sure. Um, and I guess I'm also just a little bit uncomfortable with the idea of, of like, because we don't know how much is actually pre-planned, but this idea of proposing the three expansions, it kind of puts them in this hole where like, oh, they've said it, now they can't change their mind. Like, what if they release the first one and it's garbage? And then what? Like, what are they supposed to do? They've already told us this is the plan and then it's garbage and then they can't backtrack because they've already told us this is the plan. So like, it's, it's very dangerous. It's very risky what they're doing. It's very risky. Now, if anyone can pull it off, I believe in Chris Metzen can, but um, it's just, I don't know. I don't know. Everything inside of me says like to be cautious. Do not get your hopes up. Do not think anything of this. So we'll see. Oh my God, why is it only wind chasers? Oh, there's a wrangler. Okay. I already have plenty of wind chaser crows. I'm trying not to extra kill them. I mean, I will if I have to, but I'm trying not to. So yeah, we'll see, we'll see. I don't really know. Um, but like the fact that he's back, I'm gonna kind of try to keep up with the news a little bit for the new expansion and then see and see how I feel. But I haven't played retail in so long. Like I played a bit of Legion and um, I don't know, it just didn't grab me. It was like, meh, okay, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Um, and so I really have not played WoW much since Kata. You know, like I played in Kata. I played a little bit of Mists of Pandaria, but like I was kind of like not that into it. And then like I skip, skip, skipped until we got to, um, oh, it's a wind chaser. Um, I skip, skip, skipped until we got to Legion. I heard it was awesome. I played through the leveling content of that and it was like, I was like, okay, I'm done with this. <laughs> I'm done with this. And then, and then that was it. You know, I haven't touched retail since then. So I don't know. We'll see. Is that a Wrangler? Yeah, let's get him from this direction. So we'll see. I don't know. But so long as Classic exists, I will be a happy camper. Because I still do love Classic. Level up, level up, level up. Okay, so we need some scouts. Where are the scouts? Okay. 
are you doing? Oh, trying to run away so you can shoot me. You can't shoot me. Thank you, thank you for the grats. Okay, Wrangler. There's a scout up there. What are you? You're a wind chaser? What are you? Wrangler. Okay. Let's get you, and then we'll get the scout. Oh, there's another scout. Okay. Stop it. Oh, he got really close before he wanted to attack. The other, another hope I have for Seasons of Discovery is that, you know, I know it's, like, seasonal, so, like, it's not gonna last forever, but I hope it lasts longer than a year. Like, only a year doesn't feel like a lot when they're trying to do the banding the way that they are. And I know Seasons of Mastery was only a year. I never played that, um, by the way. But, uh, so I don't know. Maybe a year is long enough, but I just kind of feel like, oh, gosh, I hope it's longer than a year. And I kind of hope they take what they learn from Seasons of Discovery and make, like, a real more permanent Classic Plus. Kind of like a lot of private servers do. Because just Classic Era with some new, with a little bit of new content and a little bit of quality of life changes, like, I would love that. You know? Like, Classic Era with Guild Banks? Yes. It's Why are you running away? I don't want to pull so many. Another scout right there. I need to get closer. excited in general because it feels like a bit of a new game but still classic yeah so many cool things that they can expand on like dungeons and new specs right because there's so much classic stuff that just like never really got fully expanded on thank you so much for the lurk lunar we love our lurkers here um like how as shara is kind of unfinished and you know they kind of teased they kind of teased like um that we're maybe getting karazan crypts like you saw that last little screenshot in the in the presentation um so, you know, stuff like that, I think, like, it's very, very exciting. Like, the potential. So much potential. Like, I would love to see a redo of the Gilneas content, but, like, from a classic perspective instead of from, like, an expansion perspective. You know what I mean? Like, that would be so freaking cool. I would love that. These guys need to stop netting and backing up. That dangerous and hardcore. They don't get me killed. Enter the cave. Why am I entering the cave? Is there a drop in there I need?
Oh, they need the cloven hoof. It says don't do it alone. I just can't do it alone. I don't see nobody. How far in the to the cave is it? Let's see. Yeah, I definitely don't want to do this without a friend. I'm just, I'm trying to remember, like, what the layout of that cave is and where you go do the file. Like, yeah, I don't, I can't do that by myself. I would definitely die. We need LFG for that. Ooh, there's a friend. Hang on, let's see what we can do. Okay, they said no. We need to get somewhere safe then. We're going to go empty our bags while we try to find a friend to do this quest with. Oop, sorry, I didn't mean to hit the microphone there. We try to find a friend to do this quest with because oh, for that shape of cave, I really do not think I should be May doing it by myself. Shine. I will definitely die. Walk with the Earth Mother. 
Uh, thank you so much for the follow, friendo. Thank you so much. We're gonna wait for the elevator. And I'm not gonna die to the elevator boss. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot of really dangerous quests in this zone, so we're nervous. This cave that we're trying to go into, it's got the same as the, um, the Skull Rock cave layout. It's that type. So pretty dangerous in there. It's twisty turny and it's I think I'm pretty sure like where you do the cloven hoof is like on the ledge below where the skull rock cave boss would be. So it's like pretty it's kind of like back there. around here we'll find somebody that wants to do it because that one person they said no but i don't see anybody else right around here right now i could ask my guild see what they say And ask these pink people. I do love this pink tabard. I spent a whole gold to be pink. It's too far away. Okay, someone in the guild said they can come help. Let's see if we can, let's see if they'll, they will. Okay, ha ah, yes. Oh my God, and it's a druid. Thank you so much. Yes, okay. Where are they? Water spring field, where's that? Is that Tanneris? Okay, yeah, so they're coming up from Tanneris. Okay, well, let's keep the entrance cleared out while we wait for them. Is no problem, I'm glad to help. Oh my God, this person's so sweet. Yeah, Gildy's gonna come help. 54, so we're gonna, it's gonna be no problem. I'll fly to Freewind in a moment, okay. Okay, if they're gonna fly to Freewind, let's walk back out of here to the road. Let's walk back over to the elevators. We don't need to go back up, we can just chill at the bottom of the elevators for a second. scout gonna attack me? Nope. Okay. Hmm. 
<clears throat> All right, let's chill right here until they're able to get here. Okay, let's see and let's see what's in, what this guide has me doing next. This is step 34. Okay, we already did the assassination note. Oh, then it says to do unrefined ore sample. That one's easy. We can definitely do that one by ourselves. Those are all in some random places around the zone. And then it says do test of faith. Okay, we can do that. We can do that by ourselves. Except test of endurance. Oh, God. <laughs> test of endurance, we could. We, I don't think we can do by ourselves. We'd have to find a group for that. Alien egg, we can do. No problem. Okay. Then Grenka. I don't remember. I don't know if we can do Grenka by ourselves or not. Steel Snap we can probably do. The Wyverns we can probably do. Almanax, hello! Almanax, did you hear about Seasons of Discovery? Are you going to roll it up with me? We, we can play, we can, we can wow together in Seasons of Discovery. It's not hardcore, so it's okay if you die. Uh, oh, this is the escort. We would need help with that. Okay. So yeah, there's a lot of dangerous stuff coming up. Oh, heck yeah. Really? Because I'm going to stream it. It drops on Thursday the 30th. I assume it's like 6 p.m. Eastern, just like they did with the hardcore server launch. So like Friday's the first full day. I'm for real, like, I mean, if people want to do it with me, like, they can. I just realized I lost, I lost a back of my earring somewhere. Oh no, I'm gonna have to switch earrings. The back of my earring is gone. It went somewhere. Okay, really? Okay, sweet. Are you in my Discord? There you go. If you're not in the Discord, get in the Discord so that you can see the announcement of um, when we're doing it. But so many people are really interested in Seasons of Discovery, so like I think it's going to be really popular. It's going to be really fun. But I'm going to set up a call for any anybody that I know that wants to roll Horde. Oh, Almanax, Almanax. I, I, I never seem to really catch your streams. I think you stream normally at a time that I... um that I don't watch but I did I do know you streamed are you doing more regularly now or, or anything like have things changed Maybe I should join. You totally should, Lunar. You totally should. I've been going daily now for a week. Was extremely irregular up until recent. Oh, nice. Okay. Well, I'll have to look out for you. I follow a lot of people, so sometimes I don't I don't see it, you know, so I'll but I'll look for you specifically. If you're doing dailies, I should be able to catch you soon. All right, while we're waiting for our friend to get here, because um, I think, yeah, they're on flight path now. I'm going to go pee. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. 
My heart is full. I'm so glad your heart is full. Okay. Oh, my friend is here. Let's go. Thank you. This way. Oh, they want to go that way. Okay. We can go that way. Follow the druid. I probably shouldn't attack because they might aggro onto me and that would be bad. So I probably should be really choosy about attacking. Freaking crowd controlling me? Crowd controlling me. How dare? How freaking dare? You are going the wrong way. Other way. Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> I need a target. I'm out of range. Let's get him. Why he heal? Why he heal? All right, we're going to do this. We're going to get that cloven hoof. That spell isn't ready yet. Okay, now she got 3 I scared. I can get the runner, though. Didn't mean to pull you in, Chaser. But it's okay if you want to die. Like, we can accommodate. I think this might be one of the guild leaders or mods. So that's really nice. That bodes well for this guild. I literally, the reason why I joined is because they posted in general or something one day and were like, we have a pink tavern. And I was like, shit, I want a pink tavern. And they said they were like inclusive and all that stuff too, which is really nice. I'm sure the cloven hoof situation is just to the left over here, if I remember correctly. And it's right underneath that ledge.
Yep, I see it. It's that brazier. It's that brazier right over there. Okay, let's douse. Got it. Okay, you see with those two guards and the position of it and stuff, there's like no way I could have done that alone. Thank you so much. You're awesome, Andrutica. Yeah, to make that work solo, I think you need to be pretty overleveled. Do you have any other quests that you need help with? Um, let me see. I don't think so at the moment. I have Hyper Capacitator Gizmo. I haven't uh, picked it up yet, but if we want to do it, that is cool. Okay, they're offering to do the hypercapacitor gizmo with me, so let's do it! I don't want to target that guy. Targeted the wrong one. To target something first. I need to get closer. Hypercapacitator should be one of these guys down here. Yeah, so we'll go down there and get it. Get up there. Okay, there we go. We're back on the road.
the kobolds that are in this zone for this unrefined ore sample that I'm gonna do in a minute are so funny because they don't like have a place where they are. There's just like random specific spots where they where they spawn and it's just like they're all by themselves. It's so weird. Oh, I just realized my Zandalar dropped. No more speed buff. Sad. Hail. <laughs> I need a target. This is a wave quest. You cannot do it by yourself. Oh, so you get all three of them up. Okay. Is that an upgrade? Okay, yes, yes, that's an upgrade. Be careful. Okay. I can pick up this while I'm here. Yo! Have a good one! This panther, this panther we're about to go kill, as a druid, I can I could solo it. But I'm pretty sure as a warlock I won't be able to. Like he's an elite, but he's not that bad. He's kind of mild. Not so spicy. Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way now. Oh wait. was one one camp too far to the side it's this one over here i was looking at the steel snap um on my mini map but he's here Okay, let's let him out. Oh wait, he's not spawned. We have to wait for him to come back. <laughs> so the story of the story of this is crazy. So basically the the goblin that gave us this quest, his caravan was attacked by the centaurs and um they had this beast with them on the caravan, but of course they left the beast for Ted. And the only way to get his hypercapacitator gizmo back is to go and uh, and get it out of the beast's cage. But he knows that that beast is like, you know, deadly. So he don't want to do that. And so, um, 
So what that means is that he's like, you go kill my deadly beast that I shouldn't have even had for me. Thank you. I will. I will be careful. I will be careful. Don't worry. We got this shit. I'm just waiting for him to spawn. But it's cool, I got my new bestie with me. See? They're my new bestie. Do I get any XP when they're in the party with me, though? I don't think I do, because of the level difference. Because I think in Hardcore, they don't want people to carry. So I think he, I don't get any. Because I definitely don't think I've seen this move. Come on, despawn, Panther. So the new one spawns. Someone must have come got here right before us. Oh, okay, it despawned, so he should be coming back soon. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. Oh, this was, this must have been, I heard the bong, the death bong while I was in the bathroom. My first blue was Enduring Cap. Oh, there he is. Okay. Let him out. Let him out. Yay! We did it! There you go. Gotta do a few more quests before I get more elite and cave quests. Will do. Okay, they are so sweet. They are so sweet. Yeah, easy. I get by with a little help from my friends. Okay, let's go turn this in. Then we'll go do the test of faith. Hey, 
how you doing? Keep it real. All right. Is that ring better? It is. It's way better than my horn ring. Okay, and that's leather. Are these feet any better? No, not really. Okay. All right, let's go do test of faith. It's back over here. Yeah. Gotta go back. Should have just done test of faith, but like I didn't want to miss out on experience or whatever, or waste um my friend's time because it kind of it kind of you'll get closer over here. Oh, it's the messenger. Let's get out the way. I don't want to kill it because I want I I already have that and I don't want to make someone else have to wait. Okay, there we go. Don't want to kill the messenger. I'm really nervous that Test of Faith is going to bug out on me. <laughs> How sad is that? I'm so nervous, though. Like, I don't know. I don't know why I'm like, like, my brain is going, it's going to bug out on you. It's going to bug out on you. But it, it, that's what's happening right now. Okay, you know how people, okay, people talk about this. And they, pe hardcore players, have talked about having dreams that they died in hardcore. I have a confession. I thought this was so silly. How could you have an anxiety dream about dying in hardcore? Wow. It's not, it's not a real, like what? But I had one. Y'all, I had one. So we didn't stream hardcore last weekend because we did the um, quiet year. So I have a week, a week off that I didn't play it. And so I was thinking about it. And I had one of those anxiety dreams. I had an anxiety dream where I died in hardcore. I could not believe it. I could not believe it, but I did. It happened. It happened to me. It could happen to you too. It could happen to you too. So it, this is, it's real. It's real. I don't know. Like why, why, why do I care so much about a game? And like, even when you die, like you can just transfer to an era server. Like, it's not like you have to stop the character forever. Not really, but I did. I had one. It didn't even, it's like, it doesn't even make sense. I can't even like, I can't even like sensically explain to you really how I died. It was just literally like I pulled too many mobs and I died. But it it's like, it's not in a, in the dream, it wasn't in a setting that actually exists in the game or anything like that. Like it was very confusing, mixed up. So I can't even really fully explain it to you, but it totally happened. Where like I, I pulled four mobs on accident and I died. I couldn't escape them. Like I popped all my stuff, it didn't work. And I woke up really thinking that like, oh, I have to make a new plan for Saturday's stream because I can't hardcore anymore because I died. <laughs> <laughs> that was my wake up thought. But no, it wasn't real. It was a dream. I know I attacked that cougar first, but he looked at me funny. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, let's do it. The winds guide you. All right. Um. Okay. It's not going to bug out. Everything's going to be fine. Here we go. My heart. <sighs> My heart. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> All right, y'all. I need a stretch break after that. I need a stretch break. So um, we're going to pause the recording here. So for y'all watching the, the recorded VOD, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Um, and of course, as always, you guys, uh, don't forget to make it a great day.